welcome back to another I Love Crafts Day Studio vlog. As some of you may have noticed, I have got myself a new hairdo. It was my birthday at the weekend, and I don't know about you guys, but for me, birthdays are kind of like times to think of what do I want to shake up, what do I want, what do I want to do differently. And because I damaged my hair so bad, <laughs> bleaching it at the beginning of the year, and it, it literally felt like there was nothing I could do to help it other than chop it all off. And I, I really like my new hair. It's so nice and easy, and uh, it's cute. I feel like a little a little fairy or a little pixie or something like that. So yeah, I'm liking my new hair and yeah, 34 years old now and excited for a new year and new possibilities. As much as I'm excited and happy um, about another year and all the things that come with it, um, I've also found at the beginning of the year that I've been a bit down and um, a bit kind of angry <laughs> and um, just feeling some emotions with like comparing myself to other people and things like that and things that I to be quite honest after years of therapy um, I kind of haven't had to deal with these ugly emotions for a long time so um it might have been just because i i was feeling overworked uh from last year my kind of like work hangover from the design challenge and i just kind of i just haven't really felt myself uh, this year so far i felt yeah a bit down a bit more angry and um not not jealous but maybe envious of uh, other people and comparing myself to other people which is so not like me at all like normally I am a little miss happy-go-lucky um, feeling fab all the time um, but yeah the, the beginning of this year has not been great maybe it's because I've been quite ill and my hair was mess and um, yeah and it's the winter so you know you're not like full of energy and full of beans and stuff like that um, but anywho, cut to the bit where things are starting to look a bit better. So I'm currently in a, a mastermind class or group um, talking to other small business owners and we chat about what's going on and um, it's, it's so therapeutic and it's so, so helpful. And one of the things that came up last week in our mastermind meeting was that um, maybe I'm not feeling um, kind of like enthusiastic or energetic about my work because I'm not sharing it with you guys because you know at the minute the themes for the upcoming months have been a secret so I've had to keep them to myself which means that as I've been designing um, I've had to yeah keep it to myself rather than be like hey guys look at this drawing I love it so much and what do you think about this idea and things like that so the thing that I came away with was um, to share what I'm doing right now rather than keep it a secret because it just wasn't working for me and just having that small decision um, has really like brought the pep back in my life and also um, I had a lovely um, birthday meal with my friend Laurie I love Laurie so much and um, she was like if, if you're feeling that kind of negative energy of comparing yourself to people on Instagram and things like that first of all block them so so I have even though I love their accounts and stuff but it just is if something's making you feel bad you should you should take it out of the equation and um, she's like if you when you feel bad or negative just text me just send me a message and we'll talk about it and oh my gosh just just that little kind of feeling like I <laughs> not that I don't have people around me but feeling like I've got like that little that little friend that I can contact when I'm feeling like that, you know, oh, it's so nice. It's such a nice feeling, and so yeah. So if 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 you guys ever feel like you know like you compare yourself or um, you feel angry about the world <laughs> or your situation, um, it's amazing to just talk to people about it and. Um, yeah just like sit and think about like what is it that's making you feel like that and how can I take that out of my life to make things easier so 
so yeah so from now on in my studio vlogs I'll be sharing everything that I'm doing and I'm so excited to do that so to catch you guys up on what I've been doing I have been designing uh, April May and June's themes for my Patreon rewards and I'm so excited to like be able to show you guys what I'm doing so um, April's theme is unicorns yay and I'm so so excited and um, the unicorn necklace that I'm doing is kind of like um, the dog pieces that I did from last year so it has little moving legs so when you wear it it can kind of like prance around and I love that so much the brooch is super cute and um, it features a rainbow and um, there's some cute little clouds in there and it's just it the colors are really sweet I can't wait for the pin to arrive because that should be arriving um, maybe at the end of the week or early next week and I'll show you guys that um, so yeah so and, and I've, there's so much that I've been doing with that like all the packaging that I've got ready and stuff like that so unicorns April next is May and that is Aladdin and I am super excited about that not sure what I feel about the new movie coming out it looks it looks all right but I I am such a big fan of the Disney one and I think I would kind of like I hadn't watched it in years and I watched it the, like a few weeks ago, months ago and it's so good like the music's all like all all the songs are awesome and Jasmine is definitely I think my favourite Disney princess at the minute because she's so badass and I love how she's got an attitude and she's so like curvaceous and <laughs> feminine uh, but feisty and oh my gosh and the colours like who doesn't like a bit of turquoise well I personally really do so she speaks to me a lot at the minute and I'm loving doing the designing on that kind of um, I'm mixing things up quite a lot so what was originally the necklace design is now the brooch design but I will I will get into the details guys I will make more vlogs and get into the details of all these bits so yeah I am so excited I don't, can you tell how excited I am to be sharing these things with you oh and then uh, June so June is going to be ice cream woohoo and ice cream was nearly a theme that got picked quite a few times uh, last year with the design challenge so it's so nice to come back to it I'm thinking ice creams I'm thinking ice cream vans I'm thinking sprinkles it's going to be cute guys I've done a few um preliminary preliminary designs um so it's coming along uh, but I will, again, I will show you guys really, really soon all the cool stuff that I've been up to. Also, I don't know if you guys can um, see by the background, because I've kept it nice and tight for today's video. Um, my office is a big mess, because also in my mastermind, what came up was um, that maybe my um, office space wasn't like sparking joy for me anymore. It was kind of, I haven't uh, moved things around since uh, since we moved uh, back into this space so it's been maybe like five years or something like that and obviously I've crafty changed a lot now I'm making bigger batches every single month and posting a lot more every single month so um, it's time for my office to get a makeover because it deserves it and um, yeah I need to when I come into my space although it's super cute at the minute it, it feels like it's not up to it's like optimum cuteness and uh, workability so I am having a makeover office makeover um, and that, that will be uh, documented in a separate video for you guys because there is a lot that I've got to say and do about it so there will be an office makeover video coming very soon so at the minute what I'm doing is I'm finishing off my Aladdin pin designs brooch design and necklace design which is looking super cute and I'm also um, finishing getting all the uh, Beauty and the Beast packaging prepared which is super cute thanks so much for watching this studio vlog it's nice to feel a bit more energy and excitement for my work again I think maybe the haircut has definitely helped me feeling a bit lighter and brighter and ready for some cute work 
all right thanks so much guys thanks so, and thank you so so much to my lovely patrons who um help support me make these cute videos and all the cute jewelry that you could ever wish to wear thank you so much guys and i'll see you soon bye